Hello, I am Mac, at least for a day. Welcome back to Kingdom. We, I think I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade my castle again. We just got through the first, I guess I'll give a coin to this merchant, see if that does something. Um, we just survived our first blood moon and, how do I sprint, there we go. Um, are those, I think I'll hire this guy, yep, and um, somebody in the comments told me, uh, oh, by the way, I, I was looking at the trophies, I figured out what the ship is, the ship is actually the way to go to the next land. If I repair this ship, I'll be able to escape and go to another land. So essentially this game has levels now where you can go to um, new lands. That's why it's called Kingdom New Lands now, um, because there's new worlds to go to. I wonder if I should hire a bunch of guys. I don't know if it's a good idea. Ah, eh, whatever. I'm going to go ahead and hire these guys. And someone in the comments said I should go ahead and explore all as far as I can to the right. And I think what happened when I did this is there's a map. I think doing that updated the map or something. Something like that. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and explore all the way to the right. Since we just got through a blood moon, it's going to be a while till the next one, so I'm going to risk going here, going this way. See if I can get any more m money. There we go. If you let your if you let your horse eat grass and you can sprint again. Ah, here we are. So it just ends it up here. Okay. So not much else here in this world. I'm pretty sure when this game first came out, it was procedurally generated so that you could just run and run forever and there was no end, but now it seems they decided to divide it into separate little levels, separate areas where where you you travel in a ship to the next land or whatever. But I'm not going to do that yet. I want to try building up my castle as much as I can before I do that. I want to destroy the gate in this land. So I'm not going to repair this ship yet. I want to I want to just see what it's like to to stay in the first land and do as much as you can here see if i can survive for a while before that i don't think i need to hire more guys i just hired a bunch so let's see uh-oh i can't upgrade the wall hmm i thought if i upgraded my camp I'd, I'd be able to Oh, far farmers, I have a farmer thing now. Yeah, let's try hiring a farmer. See what that does. Yeah, now I've got a farmer guy. That might earn me some more money. Is this, a, is this some kind of wall fortification thing? I think so. And let's get another bow guy. Yay, thank you merchant. I think if I keep giving money to the merchant he'll keep coming back and um, bring me more money. <laughs> uh, buy our stuff and, and give us more money I think. And let's get another worker. Yeah, so we got a farmer, a hunter, and a worker 
Nice. You got any money for me? No. I want to try getting rid of these trees. Wait. Do I have anyone that can cut down trees? Okay, good. Yeah, workers cut down trees, looks like. I want to see if I can build this wall here if we get rid of the trees. I just wanted to try it out and see what happens when you cut down trees. Hmm, I'm going to keep cutting these three trees down, see what happens. Fun. I really like games where you, you just try things out and see what happens. Obviously, I'm sure there's a wiki that will tell me everything that I should do, but I don't want to do that. I want to discover things for myself. And if I mess up and I die and I have to start over, that's fine. Because this game is fun like that. It's, it's fun starting over, I think. I think I would enjoy it. And if I do die, I could, like, instead of staying here next... Oh, yeah, that's what I wanted. Now we have another wall. Perfect. Uh-oh. Ghouls. Yipes. Run away. Kill it. Kill it. Ah, uh, see, he, he knocked that guy's bow, or destroyed that guy's bow. So now he needs a new one. Okay, good. So we've got lots of bowmen now. And a new wall over here. Nice. So my idea worked. Getting rid of those trees made me able to build this wall. I want to upgrade it, but I don't have enough money yet. I'm going to run around and see if I can find another treasure chest or something. See, there's like mounds and stuff, so it seems like you could probably expand your kingdom across the whole land. The way it's set up. Like, if you keep cutting down trees, your your kingdom area will keep expanding. Ooh, that's scary looking. But yeah, that's my goal right now, is to destroy that gate. But we gotta make sure we survive the next Blood Moon. So my, my plan for this series is to play five days each episode. So we'll go to a Blood Moon if I survive the Blood Moon, or if I don't survive the Blood Moon. That'll be the end of the episode. So this episode will end on day 10 when the next Blood Moon happens. Hopefully we will survive. Again. First one was super easy, but I'm betting this next blood moon is going to be really hard. Ooh, I like the music. Oh, there's a there's a stream I can upgrade. I don't want to do that just yet. I think it like makes a mill or something. Let's see. Yay, merchant. You got money for me? Yay. I'm going to keep giving money back to this merchant so he keeps coming back. Okay, I got to upgrade this wall over here. And I should probably go ahead and upgrade my castle again because we need stone walls soon. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking like I'm an expert. I've, I've, this is the first time I've played this game. Um, but... I'm just going off of uh, videos I've seen of it. But I think I need to keep upgrading to get stone walls, so that's what I'm going to do. If I have the money. Darn, I don't have enough. Okay, so we got to wait till we have more money, then upgrade and get like stone walls. If at all possible. I'm not hiring any more guys yet. I don't think I need to. I think if I get rid of this tree, it'll get rid of this camp, so I won't be able to hire guys from here. It's all stuff I saw in, a, in another video. So 
See if I stop at this grass, my horse eats. It gets its stamina back. I'm just kind of checking things out and learning. I'll probably die soon. I'll probably lose my kingdom um, on this first playthrough. But I'm going to learn as I go. Because I, as I've seen from others, the blood moons get really deadly after a while. No, no treasure chests. Guess we gotta keep waiting. Let's see. Ooh, it's day nine, so the next blood moon is coming pretty soon. I'm definitely open to some suggestions. Like I said, um, somebody gave some suggestions in the comments last time that gave me some ideas of what I should do. So if I'm doing things wrong, which I sure I am, I'm sure I am, please let me know what I should do to do better. Yeah, kill that deer. Get me some money. Kill it. Yay. Okay. Now we can... Upgrade the castle again and hopefully get better walls. I really want better walls for the Blood Moon. Yay. We've got an actual building now. No more tents. Yay! It's almost a castle. It's more like a longhouse or something. Let's see if I can upgrade. Well, I always could have upgraded this archer thing. Oh, I still can't upgrade the walls. Darn. What do I do to be able to upgrade the walls? Anybody know? Maybe you can't get to the Stone Age in this land. Maybe I have to go to the next land to get Stone Age. Or maybe it's just... Oh, I can't even... I can't even upgrade my... Um, castle anymore. So... Maybe they changed it so that you can't get stone. Oh, or maybe I have to... Like, pay for some kind of quarry. I wonder if this is a quarry. Because I see stone here. Yeah, maybe that's it. I've got to... Maybe. I don't know. What is this thing? Looks like some kind of stone quarry. Yeah, kill that rabbit. Give me some money. <laughs> kill it. Oh, thank you. You must have done a lot of hunting. Okay, we've got some money. I ought to see what these things do. See if this is a quarry. Maybe. Ooh, battering rams. Nice. Yeah, let's get those. Probably need to get more. Oh, did I just use up all my money? Oh, no, no, okay. I'm going to hire some more workers. I think the workers used the... Uh, I said battering ram. I meant catapult. I think workers use the catapult, so... I'm going to go hire a couple more guys to make another battering ram. Or pff, catapult. And that cat the catapult should help us. Oh no. There's more monsters already? It's not the blood moon already, is it? No, it's day 10. The blood moon is tomorrow. 
Darn it, I don't have the workers for the other catapult. Darn it, I should have built the catapult here because the, the, the portal is on this side. Darn it. Ah, uh, that was a bad mistake. Okay, maybe this worker, is he enough? Is he enough to do it himself? Okay, okay, he's, he's fixing the wall. Hopefully he will man the catapult now. Oh, I think there needs to be two workers for a catapult. I don't have enough money. Yay! Thank you, merchant. Oh, I think this guy... This guy lost his tool, so he's turned back into a beggar. Here we go. Gonna get another archer. Because the blood mood's coming, I need to get as much... As much defense as I can. Is that some kind of entertainer? <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I think... Okay, because I watched a video of this um, a while back, and... To get stone, the guy had to upgrade some kind of stone building that wasn't that wasn't on his castle area, and then he had stone accessible so he could build stuff from stone. But that's not in this land, so I'm guessing I actually have to go to new lands before I can build stone. I think the way they've got it set up, you have to escape. You have to escape, otherwise eventually the oh good can I build another wall here you have to escape on the ship or eventually um, the blood moons will um, become too much for you so you have to escape to new lands get stone and all that to be able to build a castle strong enough to withstand the enemies and supposedly there's actually an end to this game now um <clears throat> you have to go through like i don't know 30 lands or something i was just i'm basing this all off of the trophies i was looking at the trophies and it looks like you need you need to go through like 30 lands before the game ends and you win but don't quote me on that because i'm just guessing This, I think, is where you would order your royal guard. Oh, it's not Blood Moon yet. That's good. So I guess the Blood Moon will be tomorrow night. But I think this is where, if I had a royal guard, I would order my royal guard to go attack the portal. But I don't have a royal guard because I don't have the ability to hire one yet. Does that guy have no work? I'm going to give him a bow. Yeah. Make sure we got plenty of fighters. I don't know if I should... Yeah, I should probably... No, 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 no. What am I thinking? I shouldn't upgrade the stuff on this side. I can't upgrade this side anymore. Oh, well. We've got a catapult. Somebody fix this wall. Okay, I'm gonna hire more archers. Cause I'm betting this next blood move is gonna be really bad. So let's get as many archers as we can. Hey guys. Come fight for me. Wonder if I should hire more farmers. Nah. We're getting ready for the blood moon right now. If I survive this blood moon, next episode I'll probably upgrade the ship and try to escape. Because if there's no way for me to make stone, then I'm not going to be able to get survive another blood moon after this one. But I want to see if I can survive this one at least. OK, 
Okay, we got catapults, archers, walls. We should be prepared. But I still have money, so... Oh. Pay the merchant to come back. Um... I guess I should upgrade this, because if the monsters get through and come to this side, we'll need more archer nests, more upgraded archer nest. Alright, I think we may be ready. And the Blood Moon, I think, is just about to happen as soon as the sun goes down. Hopefully we're ready. Oh, yep, yeah, here comes the Blood Moon music. Prepare for battle! Hmm, creepy music. And it kind of sucks that there's really nothing you can do while an attack is going on. All you can do is prepare beforehand. Then if you're not prepared, you just die. <laughs> I mean, your fighters fight for you, but there's nothing you, the ruler, can do during the battle. All you can do is watch as they either destroy your castle or get killed by your fighters. It's all about being prepared. Oh, here they come. Kill him, kill him. Yeah. So far, it's still only ghouls. There's a whole bunch of other monsters that eventually appear, like flying things and bigger monster ghoul things. But it looks like we survived. We survived plenty easy. Awesome. Yay. We made it through the second blood moon. All right. Woot. Okay, so in the next episode, since it doesn't look like I can upgrade my castle anymore, I am going to work on repairing that ship and escaping to the next land. So, next episode, we will journey forth into a new land. But that does it for this episode. I have been Mac. Thank you for joining me for a day. And I'll catch you on the next day that I am Mac.